think fair share has been incredibly important for this town. Darlington is a wonderful place to live and work, but we've known that the, some of our wards have not been able to prosper as much as others, and Central and Northgate wards, I think in particular, have needed the support that Fair Share has been able to offer. I've been uh, in the North East since October 2010. Uh, I was also invited shortly after arriving to sit on the Fair Share panel. There's been a number of, of, of projects which have come to the table uh, and we have an opportunity to discuss them, discuss their sort of the long-term viability of those projects. And we don't always agree at those meetings. It's, it's not a rubber stamping meeting. There's sometimes some very lively debates before we put projects forward. I'm Sarah Small, Play Coordinator for Grandwork North East. We currently run the play service for Darlington, which involves delivering 15 play sessions a week across the 11 most deprived wards in the town. And we were awarded fair share money to help support three of those play sessions every week and to provide additional play settings and sessions during the school holiday periods. Hi, my name is Alison McKay. I'm Managing Director of Humantic CIC, which is the community interest company that owns the Forum Music Centre. Fair Share helped with the installation of a projector and screen that has allowed the Dalton Film Club to programme a weekly film club for adults and young people. In the summer we ran a school holiday film and animation week with Animex expert Dougie Pinchot. It was really successful and we will definitely run another one next year. The clubs are well attended so this all adds to the pot and helps us to develop new programmes and also contributes massively to our sustainability. My name's Tony Brockley, I'm coordinator for Darlington Credit Union. What Fair Share has done with the funding that they've granted us is they've allowed me to get back out of the office along with another dedicated member of staff and another member of staff in the office itself to look after the office side. Right, I've got £20 there onto your savings. Yes, please. Yeah, fantastic. That's great. We've managed to start really getting back into the communities and in particular under the fair share scheme into the central wards and Northgate wards. I'm Yvonne Richardson and I'm secretary of Friends North Lodge Park. We've had a number of fair share projects. The main one was the bandstand restoration of which fair share funded the events element of the match funding for that. We've also had a number of benches installed to complement the restoration to enable the audience to enjoy performances. But other fair share funding has been for a housing officer. My name's Ricky Hotton, I'm the Northgate Housing Support Officer. The community partnership had relevant issues within the area that they felt needed addressing. Primarily it was housing related conditions and poor property management via from landlords, poor property conditions. Upon that, they put the bid in to Fair Share to apply for funding to pay for the post or pay for the position of somebody to come into post to address these issues within the area. My name is uh, Saj Namia and I'm from the Northgate Ward in Darlington. The Bangladeshi community is the largest ethnic group in the Northgate Ward in Darlington. One of the biggest ideas I had was the language school. We have staff that run it and the fair share funding is what helped pay for all this to come to life. It's quite easy to access the Bangladeshi community because we can go to the BME network, which is another fair share funded programme. A bit of dancing will be going on shortly, um, some cultural presentation and networking really. So network away, please. I try to involve or incorporate all communities because I realize that Darlington have a very diverse population of people from all over. The fair share money has helped us to get this office space in evolution and the fire station for our meetings. We've had a cultural trip to Manchester in June and we have had our launch at the Dolphin Centre on the 29th of August, which was successful following all the feedbacks we got. We got money to um, put together a, what we call a, a, a micro gym, which is made up of about 10 pieces of, of, of apparatus. 
And we've seen the membership, the local membership, go from four to over 400 in that period of time, with um, not only local residents, but also groups like MIND, uh, BME groups, all joining us as well. So it makes a really vibrant atmosphere in the YMCA. Just want to go back, that's it. I'm just here to help people um, with whatever the goal is and the best way to achieve the targets, really. It's OK. I'll have to be warning. it. My name's Gary Arnold. Uh, I've been a, a volunteer and supporter of New Blood since its initial conception in 2006. Well, thankfully to County Durham Foundation, we've had quite a lot of support from them recently. The money that we got from them has enabled the, the gig sessions that young people come to every month. It's also allowed us to put on discounted recording rehearsal times. My name's Lynn Walton. I'm the volunteer centre manager here at Evolution. I actually line manage and look after the work club. With this money we can afford to open the work club two full days plus a half day. Morrison's Trust actually were lucky as well to, to win a fair shares money. The support that they give is a little bit more intense and so we offered them the opportunity to come and uh, join in on our um, sessions. My name is Yvonne Richardson, um, I'm Secretary of Friends at Old Lodge Park. We have this orienteering course installed in the park which Fair Share paid for. Um, we also paid for the school which is adjacent to the park to have a course. Fair Share paid for a summer school which clock have run and we've also done these tryout sessions. With all the projects that they've run throughout Darlington, I just think without the Fair Share money this wouldn't have been possible. The money was spent very wisely and in vital areas where it was needed at a really crucial time. So it's been a huge, huge success. I mean, the way that money has impacted, it's just beyond belief. Well, the money's been a massive help to us because it's helped us pay staff costs and things like that, which is obviously key. It's all about having the expertise of a, a player team that have got recognised player qualifications. It's just been a massive help to us um, to receive that additional funding. It's just really helped with Darlington Play Surface as a whole. The application process was really straightforward and the team at the County Durham Foundation were very helpful. Fair share is uh, an important project uh, for us and for the communities that it's serving. It's brought a, a source of project funding uh, to it. It's allowed us to introduce ourselves, to um, bring membership in from uh, the wards. It's not going to just last 2012, because I think the legacy of the work we're doing now in, in raising the awareness and getting more members in and giving more loans out has got us to a situation where I think going forward, we're going to have a lot more success in growing the business. And it really has benefited people who live in some of the wards in the town that really need it the most so I'm very very pleased with what Fair Share has achieved.